Welcome. For part B of your Earn Value Management simulation, you are to status the project as of the 20 day or 20 minute mark. So this video shows you how to do this. So as we said, this is status based on January 28th, which is day 20 of the project. So to move the status date to that time frame, we go up here and we click it and we want it to change it to January 28th and we click OK. So um, that has changed our status date and this is also to be you're to submit the earn value table. So to create the earn value table make sure you're in the task usage view which we are and then go to view and go to tables and click on more tables. So we're taking our time phase budget that we created in part A and we're modifying it with these things. We're changing the status date, it's in task usage view, and we want the earn value view. So there we go. So as you can see, it's showing us our plan value. So as of January 28th, we should have done $60 worth of work. And it's showing us we've earned $0. So that is because we haven't put in any status. So to your earn value table we need to add status. Now based on the video you are to look at uh, the status for each activity and um, this won't be in line with your video you need to make it in line but I'm just showing you how to do it. So if you click to the task tab and procure materials um, if it's 100% done you can put 100% open package and sort and label material if it's done you can click hundred percent assembly one let's pretend it's done so we'll put hundred um, percent so as you can see I'm clicking these values up here there's other ways you can do it so let's click on task assembly two and as you can see there's percent complete here so let's say it's seventy five percent so we can just type it in there so there's different ways to status it. Let's go to assembly three. Uh, let's pretend it's 50%. And let's say assembly four, let's say it's 25%. So let's click on 25%. Okay. And let's pretend at the 20 minute mark or as of January 28th, that's all we've completed. So as you um, we can see again our plan value we should have done sixty dollars worth of work our earn value for the total project is thirty two fifty so those are two important um, values that you need to note and this is what you need to submit so the one thing you needed to submit was the earn value table with percent completed so you'll go through all, each activity and anything that has status you need to status it and you need to submit this table so you also need to take note of the plan value as of January 28th and the earned value as of January 28th. So for my example, I have $62.32.50. You also know your actuals from the video, um, adding up all the people's stopwatches and giving it a dollar per minute plus $10 for the material. That's your actuals. So you now have your PV, your EV, and your actuals. Do not use the actuals here. This is a default value that assumes everything is um, what you earn is what it costs. So just ignore that. So based on your plan value that you will come up with, your earn value and your actuals totaling everything on the video, you are now also to do calculations and calculate your cost variance, your schedule variance, your CPI, SPI, um, estimate costs at complete, estimate costs to complete, estimate time at complete, and estimate uh, time to complete. So hopefully this short video helps you in knowing how to uh, status your activity and create your earned value table.